Coach, obviously not the star you want. Outside of the offensive struggles, I think the clear-cut visual was no Christian McCaffrey. They were able to run the ball really effectively, especially on the edge. What were the problems you were seeing and having in those situations where you couldn't get those stops? Now they, you know, they still have a stable of backs, but um, but at the same time, it's a, uh, you know, they're very very good up front, and uh, from an efficiency standpoint, they they beat us up front, plain and simple. Uh, we saw Sauce Gardner go out in the second quarter, and apparently it was not injury related. Uh, could you provide? He was just trying to catch. He finished the half. He was just trying to catch his breath. Um, I, I, I couldn't tell you exactly. I just know he was, he was fine. You know, I, I, like I said, uh, we never really gave him a chance to get into rhythm, you know, um, defensively, they just, you know, credit to San Francisco. They did a great job running the ball. They were very efficient in the pass game, even in the second half when we, we feel like we made some adjustments in the run game and, uh, they still were, you know, minus one explosive thought we did good in the run game, but, uh, you know, they were really good in the past game, too. You know, they're, they're an elite football team, and I know they were missing Christian, but they still have Debo and Ayuk and, and Jennings and uh, a really good old line and a really good quarterback. So, um, you know, credit to them. They executed a heck of a lot better than we did, and we got to be better. You guys yeah. weren't able to get to, to Brock very much with, with pressures and, and hits and sacks. Um, what do you believe contributed to that? They very efficient on their end in terms of getting rid of the ball pretty quick. Um, Never really gave us a chance. There was a lot of third and short, third and four, third and five, and uh, third and twos. And so we never really got an opportunity to get after the passer. And, um, you know, the opportunities that we did uh, get a chance to get after the passer, they, they did a good job being efficient, hitting, hitting his back foot and get rid of the football. So um, credit to them. I thought they executed very well today. Garrett was hot early with the four receptions, and then I think it was about another quarter and a half before he got a target. What, what happened? Like I said, uh, um, they, they play keep away. Uh, felt like our offense could never get a chance to get in rhythm. You know, the first drive had a chance to extend it. Um, and I thought Allen had a really good game minus the, the first third down. Then we had the fumble on the second drive. Um, then we had a really nice drive. Um, and then from there, it, it felt like it was a forever before our offense saw the ball again. So it, um, you know, it just. I'm not really concerned. I feel like offensively we did a lot of really nice things. We did, you know, it's just uh, for especially for Aaron on his first game back. Um, we'll definitely be better. I mean, you talked about you know not getting to that rhythm on offense, obviously, but just from what you saw from Aaron after not getting to see him, you know, in this setting ever, you know, what did you think he looked like just physically? He, lo- command, he looked fine. Command, all that yeah, stuff? no, I thought he looked fine. His command was fine. Um, um, well. We'll be better, 100. Like, percent I'm, I'm not worried. I mean, give, like I said, give San Francisco a lot of credit. I'm not worried offensively. I'm not worried defensively. We'll, um, we'll get, we'll get it fixed. Is it the We're gonna get it fixed. Defense, you know, did, did not play like they used to play. Like yeah, it's, it's any, any time, any time you get run on like that. And credit to them. Like I said, they, uh, it's a championship outfit, and they introduced us to some championship football, and uh, we'll get that. Fixed. Coach, the, the second drive, you were able to put together a sustained 12 play touchdown drive. Outside of that, a lot of three and outs in the first half. What about the Niners defense made it so difficult to sustain drives outside of the one in the first half? Now, like I said, it just um, when you're playing keep away and they're sitting on the sideline for 15, what felt like forever, uh, it's hard to keep rhythm. And, uh, you know, so like I said, we'll get it fixed. Robert, it's over the second half. It was really just Garrett. Yeah, and, and like I said, I think that'll come naturally. I mean, we had 49 plays on offense, and uh, I think that'll happen organically uh, when we're able to possess the ball and, and have a couple of uh, uh, have opportunities to drive. You know, you, you go 12 plays, and, and then from there, like I said, you, you're you just not seeing the, seeing the field as much as you want. And um, but uh, but all of it will come together, you know. For a first game for Aaron and for the for the offense and all that stuff, I thought, uh, like I said, there's going to be some good things that we can take away from, um, and uh, and now we just got to figure out a way to get better from week one to week two. Sustaining drives, though, Robert. That, that sustaining drives. That was an issue last year too. I mean, we talked a lot about you guys just not having the opportunity to make plays, not getting enough yards, on first and second down to make third. I mean, is it alarming at all that? No, the same issue no, because I, like, I think we were what uh, six of ten on third down. Um, you know the 
The disappointing one was the second and one that we did not get a first down in the second half. Uh, it was second one, third and one, fourth and one. Uh, uh, didn't convert, but uh, like I say, guys, you know, it's his, um, there was a lot of promising things. Um, and, uh, you know, from a, from a team standpoint, all three phases, we've got to be better, especially defensively, and we will. Where's Take a Mike, couple more. Where's Mike Williams and his physical progression? He's fine. Uh, like I said, we're going to be smart with him. And uh, we'll find ways to continue to implement him and, and get him going in the offense. But uh, but he's fine. He's in a good place. Robert, on the short yardage offense, uh, there was a third and one in the fourth quarter. It was Brees Hall, and he didn't get it. In, in the, also in the second half, there was a two-point conversion that was Brees Hall. What about... Uh, yeah, it's, it's something we'll look at. We could use them in those, those situations. I know that, uh, you know, the third and one in the uh, uh, in the fourth quarter, we were on the ball, uh, trying to get a quick one. But, um, but yeah, that he's, he's he could be definitely used in those situations. Robert, can your offense be effective with Aaron only attempting twenty one passes? Um, it could be. You know, I I think our run game is going to be fine. But at the same time, like that's. 40, 49 plays total. Uh, never really got a chance to establish what we were trying to establish today. Uh, Michael could have finished the game. We just held him. Um, and that was really the only thing. Yeah, it's going to be something all year. You know, when you got a high ankle sprain, you're going to get zingers. And, uh, you know, it's just something that he's going to have to deal with all year. But like I said, he, he could have came back in. We just held him up.